the world of canoe freestyle is one of the sport's most dynamic and spectator-friendly disciplines, and it's one that British athletes excel in. But freestyle isn't just about competition, and up and down the country paddlers are pulling tricks just for the sheer fun of it. I wanted to have a go, so I met up with wave sport team athlete Alan Ward at the renowned, and if I'm honest, rather scary, Hurley Weir. So what are the features of Hurley Weir and what have I got to look forward to then this morning? It's a very friendly weir as weirs go. So uh, we'll just be surfing on the wave, doing some tr trying to do some sp basic spins and some carving around. And I guess one of the most important things is uh, remembering that a flat spin is called a flat spin. You don't want to be too hard on your edges. You don't want to be leaning. As soon as you do that, you'll be catching the, the green water that runs through underneath the boat and it'll start to pull you off or you'll engage a carve, which is not what you want to do when you're doing a spin. You want to keep your body very upright, very neutral and uh, keep always looking upstream which is always a good one and just use your knees just to do very gentle edge changes as you go round through the move. Once I got out on the water and was watching some of the other paddlers I was struck by how easy they made it look. Then after a quick briefing from Alan it was my turn. I didn't even manage to stay on for a few seconds. This was going to be harder than I thought. A bit longer this time, but I was still getting kicked off the back. I needed to figure out what was going wrong. Thankfully, I wasn't the only one struggling, and the best thing to do was just to get back out there. It was beginning to dawn on me that as a slalom athlete, I've always avoided stoppers or power straight through them. So this was all a little counterintuitive for me. Maybe that's why I was struggling so much, but at least I was starting to get some turns going. Alan offered to give me a bit of a demo, and then I would try and copy him. My turn. It was as bad as ever. But then I remembered that Alan did his run in slow motion, so maybe that would help. Wishful thinking. Then, just as I was ready to give up, It may not look that clever, but I can tell you, I was chuffed. And I think that's where we should leave it and let Alan show us all how it's done.